Welcome to our video. My name is Rodrigo Viera. And mine is Carlos Ayo. And today, in our video, we are going to talk about some techniques to enhance your reading speed. This video will help you to improve your score on the TOEFL test. The first thing that we have is avoid distraction. Why do I mean with this? I don't know if you have noticed that when you are reading, you lose concentration easily. So in order to avoid that, try to pay attention closely on what you are reading. And a simple recommendation that I should give you is put away your phone. Because when you have your phone closer, you are aware of it. So put it away. Now we have the pointer method. It has a lot of names like hand pacing, the tracker and, pa and pacer method, the and the meta guiding. A teacher from Utah claimed that uh, Evelyn Good claimed that she could read uh, 2,700 words per minute using this method, just uh, sweeping around her finger uh, along with the line she read. Uh, also, you can use a piece of paper and you draw it down by your reading. It, it helps you to don't lose the line and also to keep focus in the reading. Uh, OED has a, a, another varieties like on the, with a pen, underline the, the line you're reading, but it is your choice and also work and also work for you. Then we have covers word of very red. When you are reading, you always find words that you don't know and you don't understand the meaning. So when you keep reading, maybe the word is at the top and you are at the bottom, you keep thinking about that word, the meaning, and what is doing that, what is doing there. So my recommendation for you is to cover that part of the word, cover what you have read before with a blank page. That will help you to avoid thinking of what you previously read and maintain the idea of what you're reading. Now uh, we have read more. Uh, read more, as the old adage says, uh, practice made perfect. It has totally sense in this case. Uh, as an athlete that wants to be faster, I really should do the same. For example, we had Theodore Roosevelt, the 26th president of the United States. Uh, he read uh, a book uh, before breakfast and three or four more uh, in the evening. That's a lot of books. I don't know how, how long they were, but I think that they were the average length. And also we have today Bill Gates. Bill Gates read a book reads a book per week, that means 50 books per, per year. That's a lot of books. And then this one is related to the last one. Go easy. What do I mean with go easy? When you do not have the habit of reading, start reading things that you like. That way you will develop the habit. Maybe you should read something about Harry Potter or Twilight or things like that, things that we as teenagers like. And then read something that you maybe like, but not at all, like news or articles about COVID-19 or things alike. And then after that, read something that you don't totally don't like like something related to science or geology. And if you can get the idea, if you can comprehend the idea of those topics, you will be better on your reading skill. Now we have do not reread the words in the page. Before moving any further, try to keep out this habit of rereading the words in a page at least in terms of TOEFL test or in order to secure the reading section. Because people tends, tends to track back over words they have already read. And in order to improve your speed reading, you should try to avoid this kind of pet word. Then we have benchmark your progress. What do I mean with this? An example, 
First, you read a page in about three minutes. You write three minutes and the average of, of, of words that that page has. Then you read the same page and maybe you read it on two and a half minutes. Then you mark it, two and a half minutes. So you improve 30 seconds. Keep doing the same. And the more you read, the faster you become. And always benchmark your progress. Now we had a word in improving your vocabulary. That's obviously, imagine you're reading along and you run into a word you don't know. Uh, a tip for the TOEFL exam would be every unknown word means an skip option, or you could try to figure out it by context, but the reality is that it slows you down. So the more words you have in your repertory, the less times you have to choose for the skip option. In this one, practice, practice, practice. I'm going to make it easy for you. The more you practice, the better you become. Practice makes perfect. So start reading and do not stop. And the last but not less, uh, set a goal. Set a goal yourself of reading. It could be words, pages, or books uh, that you have to read in a certain period of time and stick with it. And when you reach it, when you reach your goal, uh, encourage yourself for be better next time. And all those will be the techniques to improve your reading speed. And thanks for watching and see you later.